Welcome to Technical Laboratory YouTube channel. In this video I discuss about simulation of D flip flop in Circuit Maker student version. At first what is meant by D flip flop? The D flip flop tracks the input, making transitions with match those of the input D. The D stands for data, this flip flop stores the value that is on the data line. It can be thought of as a basic memory cell. A D flip flop can be made from a set slash reset flip flop by tying the set to the reset through an inverter. Why is it called D flip flop? The Q output always takes on the state of the D input at the moment of a rising clock edge. Or falling edge if the clock input is active low, it is called the D flip flop for this reason, since the output takes the value of the D input or data input, and delays it by one clock count. Where is D flip-flop used? Using the D-type flip-flop for frequency division One main use of a D-type flip-flop is as a frequency divider. If the Q output on a D-type flip-flop is connected directly to the D input giving the device closed loop feedback, successive clock pulses will make the bistable toggle once every two clock cycles. What is the truth table of D flip-flop? The D, data is the input state for the D flip-flop. The Q and Q represents the output states of the flip-flop. According to the table, based on the inputs the output changes its state. But, the important thing to consider is all these can occur only in the presence of the clock signal. The D flip-flop The D stands for data, this flip-flop stores the value that is on the data line. It can be thought of as a basic memory cell. A D flip-flop can be made from a set slash reset flip-flop by tying the set to the reset through an inverter. Component Secuit Design
verification. Let's simulate the the flip flop circuit. Look at the display section. It is unstable. Now, if I give input clock as a one and D as a zero, then Q is the Q is in low state means not glowing and Q bar is in high state or display is glowing again the again I give the input clock pulse as a one and D as a one then look at the display section or output section Q is in high state and Q bar is in low state so this is all about deep flip flop simulation in circuit maker thank you thank you for watching please like share and subscribe the channel